So our program takes a holistic wraparound approach to healthcare uh, because the domestic violence and sexual assault is a healthcare issue and we look at services from all the continuum, so from the time that an assault occurs and to the recovery period. Yes, uh, a lot of our clients may be seen uh, through the um, Manitoulin Health Centre Emergency Department and uh, we're working in collaboration with them so they may present through the Emergency Department, they will be triaged by the Emerge Nurse and then uh, if they so uh, seek to see our services they will, we would be called in and we would present to the either site, the Manitoulin Health Centre at Mindamoy or Little Current to see the client. Um, also, regarding who's presenting, it would be a specialized nurse, RPN or RN, who has special training for a sexual assault nurse examiner and further education regarding the uh, issues of domestic violence and sexual assault. Navigating support services within our community can be overwhelming. It can be overwhelming in any community. Um, oftentimes there are a lot of social supports, but we don't really know how to make sense of them. The navigation aspect of this role is to help clients move through those services in a really uh, seamless way. So if you're connecting with legal support, um, educational support, emotional or mental support, traditional support, primary care support, the list may go on and on. The navigator is here to help you navigate the those services. The counseling service within the Sexual Assault Domestic Violence Program or Sexual Domestic Violence Services um, offers mental health support to people who have experienced sexual assault, domestic violence at any point in their lives. So it doesn't need to be in the acute sense and you don't need to come through the forensic clinic to access the counseling supportive services. We recognize that wellness, of course, is holistic. It's not just mental wellness, it's also emotional, spiritual, and physical. So we work with a broad range of providers to help clients establish that sense of wellness. And I say that we work alongside clients because it, it comes from a very client-centered perspective. We work with you to identify the needs that you'd like to work on. And we uh, incorporate, of course, um, you know, evidence-based practices, structured psychotherapy, psychoeducation, case management, as well as traditional indigenous ways of knowing and healing. The FDVS program coming into place, we could see a lot more teachings, uh, whether it's uh, relating to self-care, taking care of oneself, uh, as well as uh, grief support, having sharing circles, um, just dealing with the traumas perhaps in relation to setting up an appointment with one of the healers if needed. Um, if there's uh, additional services, do we have the mental health services here as well, as well as the primary care. So it's integrating and collaborating also with the other programs to see what kind of uh, best fit we can do on an individual basis with that person. Um, it could be even bringing an elder to speak with or sit with the individual. So it all varies depending on the person. We are here to help you, so we're here to provide those services for you.